Hey, what is going on everyone? This is our reviews back with another video and today I will show you guys 10 awesome apps that you can get on your Apple Watch and they will make your Apple Watch more useful. Now, of course, these are not just like fun apps, but they will add actually extra features to your Apple Watch, of course, making your Apple Watch way more useful than it is with just the stock apps that you have on your Apple Watch. So these apps can be downloaded for free from the app store. I hope you guys enjoy them. Let's get started. Here are my 10 Apple Watch apps that will make your Apple Watch more useful. The first app for the video is called Moment. This is a camera app that allows you to use your Apple Watch as a viewfinder for your iPhone. Now you can do this with a stock camera app of iOS, but that's not really useful as you can only use it to shoot a picture. You can switch between different modes and all that. But with Moment, you will have all the extra features. So right here, I have set a timer, which you can do with this app. And I can tap right here to shoot a picture and you can see the timer right there. That's really cool and of course, very, very useful. What you can do is just force touch here and it will give you a bunch of other options. You can also switch the camera from the back camera to the front one. And you can also choose like timer, video or slow shooter. So really, really amazing, you can see from pictures here, we can go ahead and move directly to videos. All we have to do is just four size there, tap on video, and just like that, we can shoot a video with our iPhone, but of course, everything will be controlled through the Apple Watch with the app called Moment. The next app for the video is called Converse. This app allows you to translate right here on your Apple Watch. So all you gotta do is just go ahead and choose the language to which you want to translate. So let's choose French here. And now all you gotta do is just speak anything you want and it will translate it instantly for you. So here, hello. Bonsoir. And as you can see, once it has completed the translation, it will actually speak that word so you can hear it. And also it will show you right here the text, how you translate that word or any text that you say into another language that you choose. Of course, from here, you can just go back and you will have a ton of different languages to which you can translate using this app. So you can see a ton of languages there to choose from. The next app for the video is called Drafts and this is a note-taking app which allows you to easily and quickly take notes right on your Apple Watch. Now, of course, you can use dictation or you just can write anything you want, but of course, dictating will be much easier on the small screen of the Apple Watch. So, you want to start a new note, all you got to do is just tap right there and of course, you will have the options here. So, let's tap to dictate. This is a test note for the video. And once you're done, click done right there and that will be saved on the inbox as a note. So if you tap right there on the inbox, you will have all the notes that you have written. Of course, you can go ahead and take a look at any of them. And of course, you can also edit them here. You can also delete them if you want to. Very, very cool. The app also features a complication which you can add to your Apple Watch faces. So is this one right here. If you tap on that, all it does, it will take you directly to the app. The next app for the video is called Lose It. This is a must have app for your iPhone and of course your Apple Watch if you're trying to lose weight. So what the app does is that it allows you to basically track the amount of calories that you take, of course the amount of calories that you burn and will of course adjust your goal. You set your goal there at the time and it will just tell you how much calories you can eat during the day to achieve your goal. So right here, what you can see is the amount of calories that I have left for today. So when you set this up on your iPhone, you will enter like your current weight and the weight you want to be. And then of course the time, and it will show you this result right here, how much calories you can eat during the day. And then right here, you will see the log on the second page. You will see like how much you have eaten today, like whatever you eat, you go ahead and log them on your iPhone and you will see them all here. And once you're done eating for the day, you tap more complete. And then if you swipe here, it will show you how much like steps you have made today. Of course, this is your goal. and It will show you the result right there. And if you swipe once more, it will also show you what you have eaten like carbs, protein, fats, and all that. And then right here, it will show you like a weekly roundup. So 
this for today and the other days as well and then here you can of course go ahead and record your current weight so just see if you make progress go ahead and record your current weight right here the app also has a complication which shows you right here on the apple watch face how many calories you have left to eat for today the next app for the video is called currency and this one will keep you updated with the current currency rates right here on your wrist on the apple watch it is really really amazing you can add as many different currencies as you want and of course it will be updated all the time like right there at the top you will have the base currency so you will have the others right here now if you want to change that you can just like f touch on one of them and you can set that as a base currency then it will convert all the other ones based on that so all you got to do is just tap right there and add an amount here tab right there and it will of course show you the result on different currencies you can of course swipe down here tap the plus button and you can go ahead and add other currencies so just go ahead choose the letters right there and add any other currency that you want and then of course you can also see the chart right here so really really awesome you can see the chart during the days and the weeks right there so just like that you can have your currency rates right here on the apple watch if you're traveling a lot this will be very very useful and of course it will be updated regularly the next app for the video is called seven and it will show you some really cool workouts right here on the apple watch so you need a quick workout you don't know what to do of course you can go ahead and use the seven app right here on the apple watch so we have like a menu here you have freestyle which is random like different random exercises and then you have full body so you tap right there and you can see it will start let's go you can see the sound and all that it will show you the animation here of the basically the exercise so you can know how to do that exercise really really awesome you will have like 12 exercises right there you will have the now playing here and if you swipe on the other side you can go ahead pause the exercise you can cancel it or you can just jump to the next exercise right there so once you jump to the next tap resume and you can see right there it shows you how exactly how to do that different exercise the next app for the video is called multi timer and it allows you to set a bunch of different timers on your apple watch and what's of course amazing about the app is that you can basically run them all of them at the same time now when you install the app on your iphone you will have some preset like timers you can of course edit them on the iphone app but they will show right here and of course you can add extra ones just tap right there you can go ahead set the timer here and of course just tap start and you're good to go you will start the timer as easy as that now, if you go back you will see that timer right there is running i have a bunch of other ones here here i have one that i have paused i can go ahead and unpause that start that go back here start another one just like that you can start any timers you want as many of them as you want at the same time and you will also have a complication right here which will show you basically the timer that is about to go off the most recent one so if you tap right there it will take you directly to that timer that's really really awesome if you tap right there you can stop it or just tap when you're done the next app for the video is called lens what this app does it brings a full instagram app on your apple watch so basically all the features that you get on the phone app on the iphone app of instagram you will also have them here on the apple watch so this is the home screen of the app where you will find all the different sections of the instagram app from the home to the stories activity explorer messages profile and the search so if i tap on home it will take me to the feed of my instagram account and it is really amazing you can see all the pictures here everything you can of course go ahead leave a like on a picture you can of course tap right there and add a comment to a picture so I'll just tap right there add a comment and you will be able to add a comment to any pictures that you want really really amazing of course you can even touch on profiles right there and you can go ahead and visit different profiles and of course you can follow them if you haven't followed them already you can also tap right here to view the story so here are all the stories just tap right there and it will show you the stories this is really really amazing just tap there to switch between them so just like on the iphone tap on the side to go to the next one really amazing going ahead and having instagram a full working instagram app on your apple watch and that can be done of course with this app called lens 
the next app for the video is called Sherp, and this will bring Twitter on your Apple Watch. So right here is the app, and this is the home screen of the app. Here you can find the home, so if you tap right there, it will take you to the home feed of your Twitter account, so you will see everything here, the tweets, you can of course go ahead and like them or retweet them directly from here, so you can leave a like there. And of course, you can also tap here to visit like different profiles. So you see an account that you want to visit, you can go ahead and tap right there. It will show you all the info regarding that account. And of course, you can unfollow or follow them directly from here. So I won't do that right now, but you can see a fully working Twitter right here. Now, some of the features of this app are free. A lot of them are free. Some of them are paid as well. So for example, you can see your likes right here, but I believe like search and messages are paid. So you will have like to pay a, a pro, like a pro version of the app to get access to those features. And last but not least is an app called mini wiki. It will add mini Wikipedia on the Apple watch. Basically you can search for different articles, of course, different stuff that you can read right here on the Apple watch. So the easiest way is of course, just tapping here, search an article, tap right here, iPhone. Basically just say anything you want. So let me do that again, iPhone. Tap done once you're done and of course it will search Wikipedia and it will show you the articles regarding what you search. So let's go to history of iPhone and you will see everything here, the history of the iPhone. It's really, really amazing. You can read all these articles, basically have Wikipedia right on your wrist on your Apple watch. Really, really cool. So that is it for this video, guys. These are some of my favorite apps and of course the most useful apps that you can get on your Apple Watch. Now, of course, there are not a ton of like Apple Watch apps, so we have to dig like a ton to get these 10 apps that are really actually useful for your Apple Watch and will add like extra features to the Apple Watch. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully you will use any of these apps. If you want to download them, make sure you check out the pinned comment. You will find there all the links to these apps. So again, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe for more Apple Watch videos. I will see you on the next one.